Finally came free, squirts to the middle of the ice, and it's Romanov, the former Montreal Canadian, feeding Nelson with a shot that missed the net. Pajot muscles that to the front off of Blantimbo, stayed with it. Pajot to Riley, Riley to Ajo, wrist shot, in on goal, hung on to by Montembeau. Well, that was a horrible power play, but that's the only way to describe it, not that the Islanders wanted or practiced. And Look out here, a breakaway for Suzuki. Barlamov kept it out, and Nelson clears it away. To Suzuki, I think he got a piece of the puck. That's the Islanders, they uh, call it just half trap it and watch the moves he makes a couple of really good moves and then there's the stick right there comes out knows he's beat with the pad and then just gets the stick out what a great save that was by Barlamov that would have changed the game right all of a sudden the air is sucked out of the building you're down one up but Barlamov that's his first save of the hockey game and he stops Suzuki on a breakaway now it's Suzuki from the circles with a pass to Caulfield fires the rebound was there fight through some stick work Put it in and go get it. Gets there with Matheson. Separates him from the puck center and feeds. The is the back end. Knocked around in front of the net and it's cleared away from danger. Puck at a dangerous spot. Montembeau. And his friend's able to keep it out. Anderson flips it up and out. Romanov got a stick chick there on Tanner Pearson who was coming in hot. Pearson just wrapped up since uh, Ajo and twisted him down to the ice. That's McCauley right there. Play on. Here's Matheson with a shot. Knocked down in front of the net. Montreal snapped a three-game losing streak with a 9-3 win on Tuesday against Philadelphia as Montembeau grabs that one. Off the draw, everybody bunches up. It's Engvall to Riley. Riley to Romanov. Romanov a shot and a save from Montembeau. Oh, backspin on that. Lofting pass. Horvat tied it up so Sezikis could get there. Sezikis punched it along for Barzell. Barzell for Ryan Pollock. He has some space. Drags to the middle. Snaps a shot. No rebound for Montembeau. Sebastian Ajo has been scratched for really nine of the last ten games. Here's a steal in front. And Sezikis can't get it. Try from Horvat. Too much traffic in the crease. Suzuki down to the goal line. Slapkowski in a sliding poke check. That time from Riley. Suzuki for Caulfield. Caulfield the shot from Harris and they score. Slavkovsky parked in front may have tipped that one down by Varlamov and it's a 1-0 Montreal lead late in the first. He released at the point here. This thing's doing all sorts of things in the air. It's a knuckleball. Ducked and dived just a little bit as you see it come off of his stick. Look at that thing. It's, it's rolling on him and, and again it's a, it's a knuckleball and that just Soft touch on it, gets it into the zone as we hit a minute to go in the period. It's Newhook hurrying it ahead. Center ice, Newhook makes the pass open in front, Armia denied! Barlamov reaches out with the glove. Would have been disastrous for the Islanders and not sure how you give up a three on two in the last minute of a period. Your third man got to be in position, you can't be guessing. And and alive, what a save this is. As Barley just never bit at any point in time. He just held his position, showed great patience. Nine seconds are on now as Ryan Pollock brings it around the net. Pollock centers, save Montembeau. Point blank on Matt Martin. Five seconds to go. And an opportunity right at the end of the period. A pass out front. Matty gets it off the heel of his stick. And as I've said many times, it's tough just to score low on the goaltenders. They come across, they cover the whole bottom of the net, front in the but just the same, it's a good opportunity, but not a good. On the ice to start period two. That one gloved down by Sikis. Carried it over the line, got the pass for Barzell. Made the move, but Montembeau made the save. You don't have to put it on the stick. Guy's got good hands, and watch Ryan's got his head up. That one there is a baseball play, and Sikis watches. Looks like he loses it, slides it through, and that puck sort of laid up there for, uh, for Barzell. Didn't get as much done. And he tried to deke it, but it Gloved down by Suzuki. He moves ahead. Good read by Ryan Pollock. Pollock carrying over the line. Pollock on the backhand for Barzell. To the trailing. Horvat hit the crossbar. Jumps out of play. Dick extended, and the Islanders are able to get up on the play. There it is, the gap control. Get the feet moving. Ryan skating extremely well. And then a good pass to Barzell. Barzell sees Horvat coming down low there. Right off the crossbar. Turned it around towards Nelson. Nelson. Top Riley shot sails past the net. Pellick coming in, took a funny hop on him, couldn't shoot it right away. Now it's Engvall in the slot, scores! Oh, what a shot that was from Pierre Engvall! 
to tie the score at one. Riley just gets that puck into the corner, but talking about the puck retrieval. Yes, Adam didn't have a hold of it, and then Engel gets those feet over, cross over, square it up. Get those shoulders pointing towards the net, friend, and you can get a pretty good shot away. That's a huge goal for the Islanders. What a release from Pierre Engvall. You called it, Brendan. That thing just wouldn't cooperate with him on, on his one-handed, on his backhand. It couldn't settle it down fully. What a play by Martin. Nelson and Engvall. His shot safe. Rebound! Moncton Bowl denies Engvall on the doorstep. It's hockey game. Nelson, the shot, the rebound for Engvall, denied by Montembeau. So really another strong period so far for the Islanders in terms of not letting Montreal get some sustained pressure. Just seven shots in the game. Here comes Engvall! Save Montembeau! Said he'd get more opportunities and he just recognizes the play. Plenty of time to get the puck, tries to go. Look out. Off the skate, here come the Habs. Three on one if they push it. Josh Anderson to the net. Save Varlamov. Rebound pulled free. It's Nelson who will grab it and get it away from the net and get it out of the zone. One in the third period. Another odd man rush for Montreal. O'Reilly plays it perfect. Says, Varley, you got Anderson. And that he does. He makes a good save. Goes down. Wait for the shot. Anderson tries to beat him low. Varley says, no thanks. I've got it. And then the rebound. Everybody. Good short little passes there to, to the quick exit for the Canadians. This shot blocked by Martin. He goes down. Hasn't gotten up yet. Meanwhile, the pass from Matheson across. That one back door. And the shot from Caulfield. Varlamov looks behind him. But it's in the net. It's a goal for Montreal. They take a 2-1 lead. That was a tough break. As through his pads and then into the net. Well, he's got good position. I mean, he makes the original save. And... Now just carrying right on through. Yeah. On the inside of the left leg. Yep. Goes right, squeezes, yeah, he couldn't squeeze it. Caulfield just gets it on net. Nobody knows it's in the net, but as it goes right, it goes five hole and right back and through. Horvath to the front, and it was grabbed by Suzuki. Then Pollock let it fly, hammered it wide. Pellick. Now Pollock in front, Pellick, the backhand just missed. Suzuki is on a wraparound score! Zizekas ties it in the third. As soon as Adam Pellet gave that to Horvat, watch him go to the net. Second great look that he's had. And Casey stuck with this one all the way. What a game he's had tonight. So impressive. But what a big goal. The timing of it, you're not sitting and waiting for that goal in the final minutes of the game. You get it back right away. Caught by himself. Four minutes to go in overtime. It's Nelson. It's Nelson with a shot that's blocked. Last overtime game for the Islanders. 4-3 win in Philadelphia with these two guys combining for the winner. Paul Mary setting up Nelson. Nelson dangles the puck. Slides it for Paul Mary. He scores! Kyle Paul Mary! The Islanders win it in overtime! Paul Mary goes short side high up at the toy department right there bang and you can see that the goaltender Montebaum wasn't square to the shooter he was a little bit away from the post and Paul Mary shot it like it was a dart at the middle target look at him he takes a little look and says I got this 